Hello everyone. Today we are going to solve another problem on local attraction. Without wasting much of the time, we will we should start with the problem. <clears throat> the four bearing and the back bearing of the sides of a traverse are given below, which is given below here. Find the included angles of the traverse and stations affected by local attraction. Correct the bearings of the lines. The bearing of several lines for a traverse is given for bearing and a back bearing it is given here using this bearing we have drawn this particular figure now let us continue there are no lines in this particular traverse there are no lines for which the difference of the fore bearing and the back bearing differs exactly by 180 degree however the included angles are not affected by local attraction hence the correction to bearings of the line shall be performed after applying correction to the included angles now here uh, unlike the previous problem which we have discussed earlier the bearing for bearing and the big bearing difference is here I have calculated the difference of the forward bearing and the back bearing however after doing so we did not get any of the values which is exactly equal to 180 degree so by this we know that all of the stations are being affected by local attraction and there is some difference uh, the difference is not exactly 180 degree however the included angles will not be affected by the local attraction so we will first find out what are the included angles and we will apply the correction of the lines by correcting the included angles now let's go further now from the figure we will try to find out what is the values of the included angle A, the included angle B, included angle C, D and E. Now in this particular problem the included angle A, the included angle A will be given by, now what we have a formula by which we can find out the included angle which I have discussed earlier also there is nothing but the bearing of the previous line minus the bearing of the next line in this particular figure we if we are going to find out the bearing of A the, the uh, included angle A then we will use the formula in which the bearing of the previous line minus the bearing of the next line will be used now in the previous problem we have gone anti-clockwise in this particular problem the naming of the particular figure in such is in such a way that it is named in anti-clockwise manner so now for the particular problem a we will go in the clockwise direction so in order to find out the angle a we will subtract the now we are going in this way so we will subtract the bearing of the previous line we, we will subtract the bearing of the next line from the bearing of the previous line that is nothing but the bearing of a v minus the bearing of a e which is shown here now, angle a bearing of a b minus bearing of a E that is 195 degree 30 minutes minus 57 degree which will be give, which which is equals to 138 degree 30 minutes now next we are going in the clockwise direction so angle E will be given by bearing of the previous line that is A E minus bearing of the next line that is A E D so bearing of the previous line is bearing of E A minus bearing of E D which is equals to 
234 degree 15 minutes minus 84 degree 45 minutes that is equals to 149 degree 30 minutes then next bearing of d bearing of d will be bearing of d e minus uh the, not bearing of d sorry bearing of uh, the angle angle included angle d will be equal to bearing of d e minus bearing of d c that is bearing of d e minus bearing of d c 264 degree 45 minutes minus 214 degree 30 minutes is equals to 52 degree 15 now angle c angle c will be given by bearing of c d minus bearing of c b bearing of c d minus bearing of c b that is 36 degree 15 minutes minus 250 degree 30 minutes which is equal which which will come up to be a negative value so at 360 degree now why we are doing this one is before adding 360 degree the value which we will be getting here will be the exterior angle that is the exterior angle c here so we will add another the, neg the another 360 degree to the negative value of this angle that we will get the this value the interior included angles so it comes up to be 145 degree 50 45 minutes now bearing of b what is bearing of b bearing of b c minus bearing of b a so bearing of b c bearing of b c minus bearing of b a which is equals to 73 degree 30 minutes minus 17 degree which is equals to 56 degree now sum of all the included angles is equals to for 542 degree 40 30 minutes so now this we have to check with the theoretical sum of the included angles that is twice n minus 4 into 90 which is equals to 540 now what is the error the amount of error will be 542 degree which is the actual sum minus the theoretical value we will get this value now hence a correction of minus 2 degree 30 minutes shall be applied which will be equally distributed to all the included angles so it should be distributed equally so correction for each angle will be given by 2 degree 30 minutes divided by the number of angles this is equals to minus 0 degree 30 minutes now again after getting the value of correction or the error amount of error we will find out the corrected angles of all the included angles angle a 138 degree 30 minute minus the error or the correction so it will come up to be this likewise we have calculated all the value of the included angles now while inspecting there was no line whose fore bearing and back bearing differ exactly by 180 degree however line ab is found to be least affected by local attraction so now while finding out the dis difference now we got this difference of each uh, for each fore bearing and back bearing of each line now thus the the value which is nearest to the 180 degree is found out to be the value for AB that is 178 30 degree which is the nearest to 180 degree so which is again said that while inspecting there was no line where whose FB and fore bearing and back bearing differ exactly by 180 degree however line AB is found to be least affected by local attraction hence correction is started with line ab now we will start the correction from line ab error of line ab is given by 180 degree minus the difference then it will it, it gives 1 degree 30 minutes now again correction for each station now this correction has to be applied for 
each station that is station A and station B if we have the line AB then it has to be corrected for station A and station B now how we will correct it we will add 0, uh, 0, 0.4 0 degree 45 minutes to, for, to station A that is for the, re, uh, the four bearing of AB and we will subtract 0 degree 45 minutes from the back bearing of AB which is done here correct bearing of AB is 195 degree 30 minutes which is the given value of AB earlier we have to correct it by adding 0 degree 45 minutes that is comes up to this value now again the back bearing AB is nothing but bearing of BA bearing of BA is 17 degree which, is, which was given earlier in the question minus value of 0 uh, the the correction value minus 45 minutes that is 16 degree 15 minutes now after correcting the bearings of AB the four bearing and the back bearing AB that is nothing but the bearing of four bearing of uh, the bearing of AB and bearing of BA we will start correcting or finding out the correct values of each line correct bearings of each line using the included angle formula so now we have to find out the line the bearing of the line BC where is the bearing of the line BC bearing of the line BC bearing of the line BC will be equal to bearing of the line BC will be equal to bearing of BA plus angle B that is bearing of the line BC will be equal to bearing of line BA plus included angle C which is shown here bearing of the line BA BC where is BC okay bearing of the line BC is equals to bearing of line BA plus angle B put in the value you will get the answer then again bearing of the line CB CB is the back bearing of line BC so add 180 degree to the value of the bearing of BC you will get the bearing of CB likewise next step we are going to find out the bearing of line CD bearing of line CD is bearing of line CD is bearing of line B C B bearing of line C bearing of line C D is bearing of line C B plus angle C bearing of line C B plus angle C where is bearing of line C B 250 252 degree 15 minutes plus 145 degree 15 minutes minus 360 degree again in this we have the value which will be greater than 360 degrees so just subtract 360 degree and you will find the value of the bearing of CD now again I have already explained this particular step earlier also so let's carry on with the next step now how to find out bearing of line DC DC is the bearing of back bearing of CD so similarly earlier we have also done you, you have to just add 180 degree to bearing of the line CD so you get the value then next we have to find out bearing of the line DE how to find bearing of the line DE is bearing of the line DE bearing of line DC plus the included angle so bearing of line DC plus the included angle D it will give you the bearing of the line D D E now bearing of line D E we get the value next step is E D S similarly if it is greater than 180 degree just subtract 180 degree either you have to add 180 degree or you have to subtract 180 degree from the forebearing in order to find out the back bearing of a particular line 
next is bearing of line ea bearing of line ea you have to add bearing of line ed with bearing angle e bearing of line ed with bearing of line <coughs> ed ea with ea you have to find bearing of line ed plus angle e where is ea ea you have to find then you have to just add bearing of line ed with angle e so it is done here 189 degree 15 minutes plus 149 degree next you have to find out ae if you get ea either add it or subtract it from ea so 238 degree 15 minutes minus 180 degree you get it this value now a b how do you find a b where is a b you have to find out a b the value of a b so find out you already found out the value of a e just add the included angle a you will get the bearing of a b bearing of e a plus a 58 degree 15 minutes plus the value of angle a 138 degree you will get 196 degree which is a b which is again correct this is again come up to be the same value as correct bearing of a b now your problem is checked and it is correct thank you everyone